hello guys it's sarvesh and today i am going to make a maybe you can call it very simple python project which which i think anyone can learn and uh, it's called a random walk so this project is uh, basically based on the fact that uh, we would generate a random walk in random directions with equal distance suppose i walk uh, 15 units in particular direction then i change direction random my direction change will be random so uh, we can do it using some modules in python and we cannot usually generate very random what we called a random computer cannot generate exact random we can call it pseudo random but for our general life it is assumed to be a random so i am going to uh, make a random walk uh, project and i will i am going to use turtle graphics to achieve this and this is how our project should look like after the code has been written you can always head over to google to learn more about random walk and it's a very diverse topic random walk is a not a simple topic it uh, there is there has been many researches on this particular topic and this is the pattern we are going to achieve uh, when we write our program so let's go to the coding part so here we are and uh, many of you might feel awkward because i am using a light theme but i prefer it very much and you can just adjust a little bit and you can watch and it's your choice uh, what your screen should look like it light or dark anyway so first we will import the turtle class so from turtle module in Sorry. import turtle class all right now we will declare an turtle object t equals to turtle and t dot so let let's just check the program t dot forward 30 so what it does that it t uh, forward method accepts an distance in the form of float or integer and move the turtle that much units in that direction so by default the uh, default direction uh, for the when you declare a turtle class turtle object is 30 uh, is east direction and east direction on the screen is the uh, this direction the, the right direction on the screen is the east direction let me show you Oops. So it just disappeared. So let's just import screen also. So now, what I will do that screen dot exit on click. So uh, when I write this, uh, what will happen is that. the screen will close only when i click on that screen so now you can watch it uh, easily see the turtle was declared here and it moved 50 units in the east direction this is the default direction when we declare a turtle and we set it to move forward okay so when i and i click on this it will read it so my program is correct up to now so now uh, there are certain things uh, which i which i for well, first let's create an um list of directions list of directions in the sense that i will declare the angle so i will declare 0 90 180 and 270 so these are directions in which turtle can rotate all right so let's um, create a while loop while true 
so this will the loop loop will run continuously unless we create a break statement inside it so let's t dot forward 30 and t dot sorry t dot set heading so now what set heading setting does set heading does is that set heading sets the direction of the turtle so when the default direction is the right okay so uh, and it has the angle measure of 0 degree so when we set the direction to 90 degree it will move upwards all right and when we set the direction to 180 degree the direction will set to this left direction which is west according to the turtle model and when we set it to 270 degree uh, set heading to 270 so it will be pointing towards downwards which is the south direction according to the turtle model so let's set that uh, set heading to let's say i'm just testing it so let's just say it uh, set heading 30 it will set 30 degrees let's see this why this is what happening now and we can exit it now let's import the random module random module from the python import random all right so now what it does that we will set the heading randomly t dot set heading sorry 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 from random import choice all right so now when i set choice directions so what it does that it selects the directions from this list and the selection will be random not pure random but pseudo random and we can assume and we can assume that it is random all right so this will uh, select a random now i will just shift this line here t dot forward 20 now let's see what happens well it does create a random walk but what we were trying to achieve was not that not this one we were trying to achieve a colorful random walk and we also don't want uh, very thin lines you also want some thick lines so let's do it so we can do it we can make the uh, walk uh, line thick by the method called pen size so let's set it to maybe 6 and let's see what happens well now that looks good yeah, very good so now we also want that uh, it should have some color now uh, and if we don't have color it look like some messy pattern okay so either you can create a, a dev a function to where you can uh, generate random colors using rgb but it i think it will take many uh, much time so i will simply import a module called random color so import random color so basically uh, random color is a module uh, which can generate random colors all right so let's generate a 
let's define the color in the while loop t dot color now we will use random color and in random color there there is an random color class which has a method called generate now what it does that it generate a random color which is then assigned to the t and in each while loop the color will get changed so let's run the program and see what happens Ooh, cool isn't it and all right so we have achieved almost everything but uh, we don't also don't want that this turtle should show up it look like very messy and if you don't uh, like it you can remove it also but I think it's uh, it is it is good and if we don't want to remove uh, we can remove it also so we can do it by t dot hide turtle it will generally it will um, basically hide the turtle and now it's completely random and we can can't see how it is moving it looks cool isn't it all right and one more thing one more thing is that I can also define the speed of the turtle so generally the speed is medium but we can define it to let's say okay the speed you can define speed up from the range 1 to 10 1 is the slowest and 10 is the fastest and you can declare it also as a string but I prefer it in the range in, in in the integer form so let's declare it uh, maybe mm, maybe a maybe seven okay all right so let's see oh here we are cool so this is the random walk pattern we were trying to achieve it and you can you can learn it very it's not required to you can if, if you basically if you watch this video you will learn it yourself you can make it yourself and I want you to make a try at this and it will be cool stuff so let's you can try this okay now I don't want this because our while loop will run for an infinite time now if you want uh, that it will stop after it, it should stop after term sometime then you can declare a condition let's say while i equal to 0 and while i is less than let's say let's say 500 patterns okay so now the screen will automatically disappear all right but what we want what we want is that it should the screen should exit only when we click on it so we can do it uh, as I said earlier screen dot exit on click let's test it just for um, for 20 yeah it stopped now when I click on it it will exit so I think uh, 500 would be uh, good number and this is uh, you can say it a simple python project and if you like the video please keep watching my videos <laughs> I will not say I will not say that like my video if you like it you can like it otherwise it's okay